Hi, it's Harry Steve here. Look what we've got. We've just had these in. It's the new Tamiya Arox 3348 tipper wagon. Let's have a look inside it. So, this is based on the same chassis as the Arox and Actros tractor units, but they've uh, obviously put a tipper on the back of it. Unfortunately, as standard, the tipper does not work, but they are bringing out a motorisation kit for it fairly soon. Here is the main tipper section. Weighs well, quite a lot, it's very substantial. It's not going to bend in a hurry. I reckon this can lift 10 kilos with the upgraded motor kit for it. There's the tail get, uh, tailgate, a couple of other bits and pieces. The standard Arox body kit parts. They've lifted this straight off the Arox 3363 tractor unit by the look of it. And you've got the gearbox cases and that's all there. And then clear parts, more body detail parts. These look new because it's got the guards there for the rear light clusters. Um, interior detail parts, main cab moulding, more detail parts. And again, a lot of this is new, specific to the tipper parts. I think these must be the mounts for the tipper section by the look of it rear wheel arches, yep, very nice. Uh, that's quite heavy, I would imagine that's probably got all the mechanical bits in it. Let's see if I can find a knife. Yeah, here we go. Right, this is a first off-road tyres for the rear axles, that's rather good. They've only been available as an option part from various aftermarket companies before. And then we've got the gears, front axle assembly, leaf springs, diffs. And that is a 35 turn torque tuned motor, which again is an upgrade part that they don't usually supply with these models, you have to buy that separately, it's about £30 or so to buy separately if I remember correctly. And it looks like it is partially ball raced, but we will be offering complete ball race kits for this model as well. Um, and again, more tyres, those are the off-road ones again. More detail parts for the cab unit, so you've got the front light guards there, the air box, that kind of thing. And then we've got the package which had the instructions in it until I nicked them. Um, it's got tread plate there for the top of the wheel arches and it's got the photo etched uh, fuel tank cover. And another box of fittings here. So this is mainly small parts, so we've got the wheels, the light lenses, more light lenses there, and then chrome parts, reflectors, that kind of thing, suspension arms. These are the upper chassis rails underneath the tipper section, these mount on so that you've got somewhere to bolt all of the hinge points and everything onto. And then those are the front wheels, which I think are standard width by the look of them and then gears for the gearbox and then these which are the reinforcing pieces which bolt to the bottom of the bed there and then all the hinge points and the motorisation parts bolt onto them so by the time this is all put together it will be uh, extremely strong so yes, there you go, that's, uh, that's the new Arox tipper wagon. Um, these are retailing for £630, but our price on the kit is £564.99. And the tipper mechanism kit should be available uh, towards the middle of the 
um, middle of next month. Uh, the retail on that is 380 but we're, we're doing those for 334.99. Thanks for watching.